Hey guys and welcome back to the Homemade Haven. Today I wanted to share a little video with you guys on a challenge that we're doing this upcoming year. It is the Thousand Hour Outdoor Challenge and sounds crazy, sounds like a lot of hours and it is. Um, it averages to be about three hours a day for the entire year which we know is impossible to do because some days the weather just isn't suitable for three hours outside. But we know that there are days that we're going to be able to spend more than three hours in really good weather. And um, so we'll try to try to balance that as the year goes on. But this is something that we're really excited about. And we just wanted to kind of give you a shot of the day in our lives kind of deal um, as we're trying to reach this goal of ours. We hope you guys had a wonderful holiday season and we appreciate you guys sticking around and waiting for another video. We had a nice long break and got to um, have some family time and now we're getting back in the swing of things, getting the, the new year going and um, this challenge is something that's kind of getting us up and running and ready for some some new things this year so we hope that this video inspires you and gives you some ideas maybe this is a challenge that you want to hop in on to I will leave the link to the Instagram account Facebook account um, and the challenge website um, below if this is something that you're interested in being a part in and um, even if you don't decide to do a full thousand hours just challenging yourself and your family to be outside more and setting a goal of a really high number of hours um, because anything is better than what most kids and families are getting these days. So um, we think it's important to get outside, get some fresh air, to be in nature and just really um, see what all God has put out in the world for us to explore and adventure and anyways, we hope this video gives you a little bit of inspiration and maybe gets you and your family outdoors too. We hope you enjoy. Load up. Good girl. Load up. Good girl, good boy. here to the land we're going to spend some time outside 
soaking up the sunshine. It's a nice like 58 today, so not super warm, but in the sunshine, it's nice. So we're gonna take advantage of the nice weather and do some school outside. Um, and right now we're getting ready to eat some lunch. Um, also let the dogs play, run, get some exercise. We have been taking part in the thousand hour outdoor challenge. And so we're trying to find every excuse we can to get outside, um, especially when the weather is nice, which can be kind of tough when it's in the middle of winter. But thankfully we have pretty mild winters here in Eastern North Carolina. Um, but we have had some really bitter cold days here recently. This morning we started our morning off um, outside doing a little bit of exercise and reading our Bible. Then dad came home for lunch, we packed up, and now we're out here gonna spend some time and enjoy this beautiful weather. All right, so what did you pack yourself for lunch? Got a little charcuterie spread here. Got some salami and olives. Some cucumbers, apples, yogurt, and hippie puffs. Pretty good. These actually are pretty tasty. They're a coconut um, based yogurt. So if you're trying not to do dairy, it's a good alternative. They have 10 grams of protein and 7 grams of sugar, which is still more than I would like in a yogurt, but a heck of a lot better than most of your store yogurts and they're really tasty. And for me, I wasn't super hungry before we left the house, so I just packed a couple snacks. We got some um, beef jerky, a yogurt for me as well, and a banana with some peanut butter. Nice, look at that. Mm. So we're about due for a house progress video update. Um, I'm gonna wait a couple days just because there's a couple things that are getting tied up that I would like to include in the video. But you probably got a little sneak peek already from footage in this video. If not, I'll give you a quick sneak peek of the outside. Check it out. It's got siding. We've been joking around since the siding's been put on and saying that it's so exciting. <laughs> I know it's corny, but we have to um, keep ourselves laughing and, and joyful and excited and ready to get into this house because these last couple weeks are kind of just dragging by. So we're trying to do a lot to keep ourselves busy and um, put our focus elsewhere so that it doesn't seem like we're just sitting, waiting, wishing to get into the house and um, live here because truly we really are. We're ready to be here, but there's only a few things left to do and we're just gonna hang in there, stay patient, stay the course. We are thankful that we own this land and are able to come over here and enjoy it even without the house being finished because this is our little our little breakaway area our little place of peace we really enjoy coming and um, getting out of the neighborhood out of the townhouse away from people and just in nature and just enjoying this property exactly like how we intended to when we first bought it and had the vision of building here. So we're getting there, not too much longer.
Thanks so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please give us a thumbs up. Leave a comment below um, if you're planning on joining in on this 1,000 hour outdoor challenge this year. And if you haven't already, consider subscribing to our channel so you can follow along on our journey. We put out new videos every so often about homesteading, homemaking, and homeschooling, and pretty much all things that revolve around the home. So we hope that you will join us, and we will see you guys on the next video. Bye.